Rick B's Daily Vlogs. With Waikiki right there in front of us, we're headed a different direction. Let's get this started. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Welcome everyone, it's my daily vlog channel, Eric B's Daily Vlogs. Up north a little bit today, not that far from Haliva, and I gotta make a correction too, because yesterday I kept saying Kalua, 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 it was Kualoa, Kualoa La Ranch, not Kalua, Kualoa Ranch. But today, we're here for one, one special reason. Let me show you right in front of me why we're here. We are here at the Dole Plantation where you can get some pineapples popular for their Dole Whips, their pineapple candy. We're paying a quick visit to the Dole Plantation and before we go let's go check out the map that they have. Last time we were here, we did that right there, which is the maze, and we never finished it. There's a train ride. It's called the Pineapple Express, of course. And I got other things that we can do here. But we're gonna go inside, because I need some coffee. Do they have pineapple coffee here? Let's find out. As soon as you come in, you're greeted with Maui divers. We're gonna come right in. And as soon as we come in, there's a whole plethora of pineapple, Dole Hawaii. You can get yourself a Dole Hawaii shirt, which is green. I'd rather get the yellow one. That's the color of a pineapple, but should have been like red or black signage or writing. Magnets, keychains. You can have someone draw your name if you like. Get some Hawaiian jewelry. A lot of things, but we're here because of not these guys. Um, oh, Let's see. Not these guys either. They're here somewhere and I'm gonna find them. Is it these? Is these the candies that we're looking for? No. Maybe they're over here on this table. No, they're not here either. This table doesn't have it either. Wait, wait, wait. They do have it. It's right there. They have it. I'm buying all of it. All of it, you hear me? All of it. But before that, there's some coffee. I'm gonna get some coffee. It's coffee time. They serve this kind of coffee here, so that's the kind of coffee I think I'm gonna get. Line's not that long. Let's get some coffee. But I gotta go through the right side. Probably more important than any of the Dole Whip here some coffee. Some nice coffee. These pineapple macadamia nuts and these chocolate macadamia nuts here from Dole are supposed to be really good. And these shortbread macadamia. Might have to get a few of these as well. These lily koi shortbreads are supposed to be really, really good. And I think it was these macadamia nut cookies that's supposed to be really good. Regardless, they're all gonna be good here. Only in Dole where you'll find some pineapple co cotton candy, or this is pineapple coconut cotton candy. And then over here, they have a banana cotton candy. Not sure what it's gonna taste like. 
Maybe it was these shortbread cookies that's supposed to be good. But these coconut. Oh my god, so many to choose from. So many cookies to choose from. Which one am I gonna get? So many, so many. And you can get yourself a bag that says historic Wahiwa Town in Hawaii, the Dole Plantation. It's a nice bag. This looks like a cooler bag, too. Yep, it's a cooler style bag. And in case you're hungry from all this shopping, they got some fresh made hand rolls. That one right there looks really good. Spicy ahi. But they got other types of rolls. And they got a poke bowl. Right here. And the world's famous, or Hawaii's famous, Spamasubi. They got a special deal. Buy two sippy cups, get one for free. And that's that right there. So, we might have to go on that route. Either that or we just get a special cup. But this is what they got to offer. They got the Dole Whip ice cream. Dole Whip, I guess, ice cream in a cup. Another Dole Whip with some toppings. The waffle cone. A waffle cone with, looks like, strawberries in a cup. They got the pineapple split. Not the banana split, but the pineapple split. They got a pineapple float, just right there. And then the sipper cup float. How cool is that? One of the ones that they got is the waffle coat and pineapple. And look at that secret in the back. It has a pineapple. And of course you can't leave here without getting a souvenir cup from Dole. It's a, it's a pineapple float. Always a must when you're here to have, try one. Only bad things about these places is that, just like Waikiki, it's a big tourist trap. They know you're gonna come in here, they know you're gonna buy stuff, they know you're gonna pay the money for it. We did, and we ended up buying three of these. But, what, we're not gonna be here for another, another couple years, maybe even another year, so might as well do it now. Never know, right? The way that things are, they might get rid of the Dole Plantation. They might. And we have to settle for Dole Whips in Anaheim and Disneyland, the other happy place. Right outside of the area, you have this whole outdoor eating area where you can eat. You got some umbrellas, you can even be under here. They got the train tracks. If you look in the distance, you see where everybody's standing over there. They got the Pineapple Express. Over here, they got a big pineapple, and it's a direction towards the maze. Let's go check out that area. Here's a brief history of the Pineapple Express and how they used to take the trains, load them up with pineapples, and distribute them all the way down to Honolulu Harbor, where it's shipped all over the world for our, for our enjoyment. We got some, and again, there's a long line, a long line up there. It's nice and hot today, too. And as we walk along this area, it might look like normal plants to you guys, but they're actually pineapple plants. Some little baby pineapples, if you look really hard. Probably not here, but there is some, some pineapple plants all in here, because this is a dole plantation. Here's the Wailua Estate Chocolate. They got some chocolate beans up in here as well. Look at that. Each cocoa tree produces 40 to 100 football shaped pods. Wow, that's a lot. They got the entrance. They got a big pineapple. And they got the entrance to the maze. And where you can actually buy and purchase some tickets. Right here. Right back here, they got the different types of pineapples that they're growing. And right here, see right there? They got some pineapples. Not quite ripe or ready to be picked, but they have different markers. This is Dole 30 right here. And some pineapples ready for the picking. Let's see which one this one says. This is 
the Brac Bractitis Titus. Not sure if I'm saying that right. But they have more over here. This is the McGregor. Probably the people who owns the area or owns the site. These color pineapples are more what we're used to looking at. The more green, the lush green looking of the pineapples. All right here. And then this one's called the Albu Albus CB73. But these are the pineapples that we're used to seeing. This is the back area of the train ride. If you look in the distance over there, I have a mango tree. And then the train ride just takes you all around the plantation, shows you the different types of pineapples and what else besides pineapples grow on this plantation. Dole's pretty big when it comes to certain things like bananas. They have pineapples. They have pears. Not sure if they have apples, but they might. They might. And it's nice to see that they're using solar power. They're using the power of the sun, something the ancestors didn't have back in the days. They had to rely on manpower. And now they have solar power. Look at that right there. They got the cacao chocolate. That's the tree. In case you get lost, they got this little sign right here that tells you which way you're going or how far you are from home. I think I like the eight mile sign to North Shore. That's probably where we're headed, back up north. This is the entrance to the Pineapple Garden Maze. Last time we did it, we failed. We didn't finish. Too hot to do it again. So not today. That is it from the Dole Plantation here in Wahiwa. I'm gonna head up north, see what trouble we can get to back in Haliva. There was a TNC shop there that I wanted to get some stuff, and they got a local Starbucks, so we're gonna see if the local Starbucks has some Starbucks mugs, because we collect those. So let's go head up to Haliva up north. So we're done here in Wahiwa at the Dole Plantation. Let's go. Back in Haliva. This time, we might, we might get some ice, some shave ice. We might. Line's not that bad, so we're gonna go Hit some Matsumoto shave ice. Made it in. Line wasn't that bad. Getting ready for some shave ice. Besides the ice cream, you can come into the general store and get some shirts. Got some nice good ones up here too. And here's what everyone waits for. A nice snow cap with ice cream in the middle. Tropical flavor. Ready for some Matsumoto. We are done at Matsumoto's, done at Haliva's, or in Haliva. I'm gonna head out, probably just drive around the island, and get lost. That's the whole adventure's about. Had fun this morning at Dole. Came over here to the North Shore to Haliva's, and now we're just gonna go chill and relax. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget, follow me on this adventure. You can also follow me on Instagram. I'll leave links to, to that down below. Facebook and Twitter, I'll leave links to that down below as well. But we're done here in the North Shore. We are done at Matsumoto. We are done at Dole's. It's time to just unwind 
and hit the beach. Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thumbs up for watching, guys. The Hawaii adventure continues. Logs ended, guys. Go in peace.